All right, Pisces. So I'm um, I'm getting all kinds of different information. I well, first of all, I'm being led to the Hermit, which represents Virgo, and you know this to me is coming up differently because probably because I'm reading for so many of you. I feel like for some of you, this could even be representative of you where you're very much um, isolated or this could represent somebody in your life where you find them isolated and withdrawing. And I feel like there's a back and forth. They're going back and forth. They're coming in, they're going out. They're coming in, they're going out. And I don't know if this is possibly health related, but <coughs> excuse me. Okay. Maybe this is health related or with uh, smoking or I'm getting smoking gun. There's smoking gun. I feel like this is kind of, I'm almost picking up as the smoke. I almost feel like somebody is trying to communicate with you. Be careful, possibly, where there's smoke, there's fire. I feel like there could be uh, somebody or a situation that could be volatile somehow, or they keep maneuver. I don't know. this. Now, this could be global. Like, this could be in your community or even bigger. But there's somebody that... Um, I feel is very much hiding secrets or I don't know, keep getting smoking gun. Like I, I don't know. If, uh, I'm getting imbalance. So it's very much this back and forth, this roller coaster. I, it's almost like I'm, I'm, I'm coming and then I'm going, I'm, uh, like my, I, I'm almost feeling like this person. I don't know if this person talks like really fast, if they uh, appear and disappear, or if this is a, um, a situation that, um, is in the work environment where I, I, it's like they're, they're there, they come in and they're gone, or I don't know. I just feel like, if you're around somebody like this, like kind of be cautious or protect, protect, protect yourself somehow, emotionally protect yourself mentally. Uh, because I feel like this is Gemini. This is Virgo. I don't know if that has any play, but look at this rush of energy. It's, it's like all of a sudden, I don't know if somebody changes. I mean, this is Gemini. So as I often like to show this, you know, it's like somebody can be one way. See how they're with that. No, the camera is not focusing at all. That's annoying. <laughs> Where they're, you know, blue and white here. And then there's an, well, that's not going to work. But there's another side to them. And then things are kind of gray. See that? So uh, I don't know if there's, I don't know if somebody is being demanding and they want things their way and they have to understand that it's a like a two-way street. May also uh, be indicative to of somebody in terms of like they're, they're going up and down with their moods. Like sometimes they're, they're closed off and shut down and all of a sudden they're ready to go. You know, I, I'm getting this extreme, this extreme changes. Now this also in another way, I also feel that all of a sudden somebody is going into possibly surgery or uh, like all of a sudden you hear like, I don't know who this is, but they're having surgery in order to see something. And I feel like it could possibly be, uh, I don't know why I'm getting this, like ovaries or, uh, you know, I'm getting like ovaries or f something like that. 
But I also feel that you might be in a field like I'm getting military or private investigator or I don't know, something with computers, with security, that all of a sudden something comes in, they're trying to attack the computers or like phishing, P-H-I-S-I-N-G, and, uh, you know, all of a sudden there's like an attack, there's an attack on, and, and this may all of a sudden you're having to move or somebody's on the move or you're having to, you know, all of a sudden you're having to travel or somebody moves you. So this could very much be work related because I'm getting communication these with these swords here. And, but I feel like there's security also, but I feel that if there is somebody that's a little, you know, listen to your intuition. If they're a little back and forth or, or if they're pushy, like pushing themselves, you know, just be, so this could be like new love coming in. This also could possibly be somebody from the past that comes in. Uh, but you're like, just be aware, like history repeats itself. Um, so if you've been, you know, because I feel like it would just be kind of up and down all over again. So if somebody's making promises, uh, they may not be able to keep them. Also, this Knight of Swords comes in, and this could definitely be an air sign, doesn't have to be. But, you know, we do have two swords here. We also, um, as I said, had Virgo, but... So the swords are Aquarius, Gemini, and Libra. So how appropriate that we have another, this, this for me is my Gemini card, but it could be that whoever this is that may be coming in and returning, they will come in fast and they will leave just as fast. So there could be communications from somebody from the past. And if there are, you know, make sure that you see the light that you you know where this path is going possibly or um there's something for you to see regarding the situation so you know if you get an inkling like something's not right it's probably not right because i'm picking up like military or even um I don't know, smoking gun. I don't know if a gun or smoke, but I keep hearing like where there's smoke, there's fire. So um, I don't know. Maybe this is fire in terms of like land. Like, I don't know, over land or, but I'm getting also travel. Or somebody's on the move. Could be that somebody is is looking for somebody and they're traveling to find them. That's another way that I'm picking this up. Let's see what's in the outcome, okay? All right. So, oh my goodness, another sword. And another, oh wow, we have two twos. We actually really have three twos. And the reason why I say that is when I see Gemini, I feel like there's a big decision. There are some major decisions going on. There's something that you need to be, that needs to be seen. I don't know. Maybe somebody doesn't know that they're pregnant and all of a sudden they get the news they're pregnant. Like they had no clue. I don't know. There used to be a, a, a TV show. I um I think I saw it one time where so I didn't know I was pregnant. And that's what I, I feel like there's there is something that that seeing is going to be very important. You know, I also got that maybe somebody's having surgery on their their eyes, like uh cataract surgery. So I wonder so that they can see better. So there might be surgery. Um, so this could be 
um, somebody close to you or, you know, motherly figure, grandmother, fatherly figure. Yeah, that's that's also what it could definitely be. Something with the eyes that someone's having surgery on so they can see better. Because there's a play on seeing. But you know what? I'm also very much focused on protecting. Protecting your heart. So protect your heart. Uh, especially if somebody keeps coming in and out of your life. Or if somebody is... I'm trying to get this situated here. If somebody is very much in and out, or if they're just communicating, like if you've been communicating with them a while, just like on um, Facebook, well, I, whatever it is, a website, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, or whatever, I, I'm hearing what you see is not what you get. So I don't know if this is like that, you know, that program catfish or what they call it, like that movie catfish that then became a big program where you go and meet somebody. So you may be traveling to meet somebody and I don't know if you just miss them or if because uh, or if you go see them and uh, they're just not what they portray themselves to be. So make sure that if you are wanting love in your life or you're wanting to meet someone or if somebody already is in your life or and they're going back and forth or something's up, like just listen to your intuition, as I said earlier, but I feel like there is definitely need for protection and definitely a need to see something or get enlightenment. This may even be a need to see something within yourself, whether it's mentally, emotionally, physically, or spiritually. If it is physically or you're feeling something, definitely go see a doctor. Um, but this could also be that there is something that you know about that you're not wanting to look at. And that's why this is in the, in the outcome. You're not wanting to really see it because if you see it, you have to then make a decision. And maybe this isn't you, this is somebody around you, but they have to make a decision and it's going to affect you, whether directly or indirectly. So, but I, you know, I'm focused on the water. This may be traveling over water, but what I just heard, what usually I think of this as water or the ocean, but I just heard sea like S-E-A, which is a play on S-E-E. -E. There's something to be seen. So really pay attention in March. Um, excuse me. And, and very much listen to your emotions. You know, look at how you feel. But, you know, we have a lot of swords here. And then we had the wands. I don't know. I am possibly getting, I don't know if this is uh, shipping yards or shipment, shipment. I wonder if somebody's shipping something. Shipment, ship, or um, I don't know, maybe this house, this could be travel by boat. I don't know why I'm getting that. Maybe it's Navy. Maybe that's why I'm getting it. But lots of movement and choices to be made. Things to look at, observe, and then go ahead and make your move or make your choice. All right, Pisces. Wow. Very, I've had some very strong, powerful readings for for quite a few signs, I think for almost all the signs, to be honest. So if, if this doesn't correlate or make sense, 
uh, then definitely, you know, watch your rising sign or watch your moon sign in terms of emotions to see where emotionally possibly you're at. But um, I don't know. I'm just looking at, I feel like I was focused on her feet for some reason. I don't know. Footprints. Footprints in the sand. Why am I getting footprints? Um, imprinting. I don't know. Somebody, you know what? I think somebody has left their mark. That's what I'm hearing. Someone has left their mark. Or, and this may also be very much like criminal, a criminal investigation going on. So like detective, military, police work, someone's left their footprint. And I feel like this is like an investigation going on. So this, this is on a global level in some aspects have, has pop, pop, probably nothing to do with you. But I wonder if there has been, uh, somebody that has committed some crime with, with a gun or sword. Well, a knife, I guess, and somebody is looking for them. So, and they're on the move. That's, that's something that I'm picking up. So that probably has nothing to do with you unless you're like a private investigator or detective watching this or in the military, but all right. Well, Pisces, thank you so much for watching. I very much look forward to our next reading. Um, and the, you know, I also feel, just want to say this, that I feel that for some of you, and I, I'm sorry if I said this already, but there's some, um, I almost feel like there is insight to be gained within yourself. I think I did say that because I did. Yeah. Emotionally, mentally, and spiritually. So this could be a battle within yourself also. And you may be going someplace to get like, because I almost feel like near water or something to try and gain some insight, or at least you're thinking about it. Maybe you haven't made the decision yet. 